Hey, good morning, Calvary, and Happy New Year. I know, I know, it's, it's New Year's Eve. It's December 31st, the last day of 2021. And I pray that 2021 has been a year where you've experienced God's blessings and joy abundantly in your life. And, and if it hasn't been that type of year, then can I encourage you to go ahead and take a little time and, and grieve your losses and, and forgive the hurts that have been aimed at you? And, and maybe learn from some of the mistakes you made or some of the uh, experiences that you suffered just so that you can uh, grow out of the pain. And then today I'm going to encourage you to commit 2022 to Jesus because it starts in a few hours and, and we want to live it for him. And the best way that I can imagine that, that you could commit the year to Jesus is uh, found in Psalm 1, verses 1 through 3. Uh, the writer says, Blessed is the man who does not walk in the counsel of the wicked or stand in the path of sinners or sit in the seat of mockers, but his delight is in the law of the Lord and on his law he meditates day and night. For he will be like a tree planted by streams of water, uh, yielding its fruit in season. Its leaf does not wither. Whatever he does will prosper. Think about that. If, if you focus your life on the Word of God and you practice what God's Word says, you're going to be a person who prospers. Uh, and it's not promising prosperity like, you know, financial and you'll be wealthy and healthy and all that kind of stuff. It's just saying that God's going to bless your life and you're going to have more love and more joy and more peace and more patience. Your life's going to be filled with kindness and goodness and gentleness and self-control and, and you're going to find the freedom in Christ that you really want. So my prayer for you is that you really can grieve and forgive 2021 and all the pain that was there. And my prayer for you is that you really will listen to God and apply his word to your life like never before and live in the blessings like a tree planted by streams of water whose leaf never withers and bears fruit in every season. Because that's what God intends for you, for me, for us. So God bless and happy new year.